What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit. We are here on Forza Motorsports 7, staring at my ESDA prepped C5 Corvette with the usual suspects livery on it. Fortunately, I haven't gotten this car into actual battles, but I'm working to get my ESDA license through the SSR Pro series. So uh, make sure you guys follow my endeavors and trying to get my ESDA license this season. So, but we're here to talk about, if you haven't guessed by the title of this video, a giveaway. From the usual suspects. This is not from me. This is from the team, the usual suspects that I am a part of. They are actually giving away a bomb grand prize here. They're giving away a TMX Pro and Forza Motorsport 7, as well as usual suspects hats, which I don't even have a usual suspects hat, but you can get one before me. And I'm part of the team. Definitely a cool thing to try and grab if you want, because, you know, definitely a team that's put in work to get to where they are. And I'm glad to be a part of them. So, like I said, they're giving away TMX Pro, and they're giving away Forza Motorsport 7. Very simple way to get it for yourself, and get yourself into this drawing to try and win it yourself. Simple. Go to Instagram. Make sure you follow and like the post on The Usual Suspects. I'll leave their link in the description box below, or you can just go to Instagram and search Usual Suspects FM. Um, it's right here on the screen. And... Uh, Follow them. Give them a follow. Definitely uh, an amazing team. Glad to be a part of it. Follow the instructions on the post for the giveaway. Very simple. Comment your three friends' names or something like that, and you know you're good to go. It's, it's simple. All you gotta do is follow and like and post. Very simple to get yourself in to enter to win uh, TMX Pro and Forza Motorsport Seven, so you can start your drifting endeavor racing endeavor if you don't have one already or if you want to get into the wheel endeavor yourself uh like myself and a bunch of forza players you know here's your chance here's your chance to win a tmx pro from the usual suspects big shout out to the usual suspects for uh giving you guys the opportunity to win this so like i said i'll leave everything in the description box below so you can go to instagram find all the rules for this giveaway it goes through the end of the month drawing will be beginning of next month so you guys got a month to get in there one one drawing per person so you can only comment once um but like i said great opportunity for everybody to try and win a tmx pro so if you don't have a wheel and you want to get on the wheel game now's your chance go to usual suspects give them a follow great team very excited to be a part of them you know it's increased my driving as a drifter and a driver on the sim games you know being a part of the team, learning tuning aspects from some of the guys, you know, liveries, obviously. They have amazing painters part of the team. So we're going to get into a little bit of slidey stuff today with um, my E92 that I'm probably going to be using for SSR. We're just going to run in some Long Beach, maybe some Road Atlanta, just, you know, rip a couple of the tracks that are going to be in the SSR season other than Yas Marina and make sure the car can handle, I would say, other tracks that it will be having to go into if I decide to use the E92. So, because that's a lot of people, and a lot of people are saying E92. So, I kind of am very fond of this E92. So, a lot of people have been saying for me to use the E92. So, that is what we're going to try and test out today. So, we're going to get that uh, camera turned on. We got our, still got our minty green Nero Chrome wheel on the uh, on the rig. We did get some, uh, some new gloves that we're going to be rocking today. So let's switch it up. We're going to go straight to Long Beach. We're going to run some basically uh, some uh, qualifying runs at Long Beach, probably Road Atlanta, and uh, see how comfortable we are with this actual E92. So make sure you guys follow me on Instagram and Twitter, all of which are also found in the description box below. And uh, make sure you get yourself in to try and win that uh, TMX Pro wheel because it's definitely a great opportunity for you guys. So this is actually my first time with this E92 built to these specs here on Long Beach. So like I said, very comfortable with this car and a lot of people were saying I should use it. So we're going to see if this car is capable of running other tracks that are in the SSR season to make sure because there will be no point in running this car if it's not, if I'm not comfortable with it at other tracks in the season because I don't really want to switch cars throughout the rounds I want to stay comfortable with one car and stick with one car just maybe tweak the tuning settings a little bit but as long as the base setting that I have on it is a uh, good f 
for all around for all the tracks we uh we should be good to run this car for the SSR season so we're gonna heat up our tires a little bit so make sure you guys follow me on Instagram and Twitter all of which are found down below as we just totally biffed our corner bumper already but eh, whatever it's gonna get walled out probably first run here at Long Beach in the C92 SSR spec throw it in not too bad a little bit off the wall I'd like to be closer not that close so a bit of suspension tuning will have to be adjusted here for Long Beach but I feel like the basic tune is uh it's quite okay and uh I feel like I would be pretty comfortable with that that was a weird entry pretty comfortable with this car in the Long Beach aspect now the other track I want to try is Road Atlanta I know I shouldn't be testing Long Beach got somebody rocking out music outside all right so our tires are a little bit warmer for this run so we're gonna give this a shot as I just roast them not realizing that I have to uh, do my 50 roll Kick it in. A little bit of a wall tap, unfortunately. Not what I want to do. And then that put us offline for that. So maybe there's some fine tuning that needs to be done to this car because it's not a. Uh, the power is not really there when I need it to be. So tire pressures and gear ratio need to be probably changed a little bit for Long Beach. But for on a basic, basic stance of the car. I feel like it's a decent setup and it should be okay to modify the tune a little bit for Long Beach. I am going to miss the Long Beach round because I will miss round two and I believe round two is Long Beach. So we would have to really test this at Road Atlanta, which I feel like we should do. So we're going to go switch this to Road Atlanta and give Road Atlanta a shot. And see how uh, get an itchy nose. See how um, this thing does at Road Atlanta, because that will be, I believe, round three that I will be running, and I hope it is the actual FD section, because, well, I don't know any other sections of Road Atlanta that are actually really good for drifting, other than the back SC section. But I feel like that's not a great tandem section to run as, say, like a comp. So, I'm kind of leaning towards the C92. Like I said, I still have two weeks or so to pretty much finalize a car. But I feel like I should finalize it here soon so I can get into tandem practice with some, um, some other teams and stuff like that. And uh, other members of my team just to make sure that this car is... I can follow with the car. Because if I can do leads, that's great. And if I can qualify, it's even better. But... I need to be able to tandem. I need to be able to be as close as I can. I need to feel comfortable in the chase position with the car in order for me to want to actually, you know, take the car into, say, competition. I feel like I'm going to be way, way too quick in this car gear wise. I think I'm going to be in the wrong gear ratio set with this car, but we're going to give it a shot. Kind of like my Corvette revs out right when I should initiate. So not a bad run for the first time out of Road Atlanta in this car. I feel like I probably gonna stay in third, but I feel like this is actually very decent and uh I think we'll be good with this car here at Road Atlanta. Maybe some fine gearing adjustments and stuff like that to stretch that third gear out a little bit because I'm not much of a fan of pretty much revving out on initiation because I don't have that leeway if I need a little more speed. We're going to try to keep this in third gear. Nope, second gear is definitely the option in this section. 
second to third quick gear change we'll be more comfortable in this horseshoe here at road atlanta so we're gonna run probably one or two more here before we end this episode off but this episode was mainly to get you guys to go follow the usual suspects and you know, suspects but can't speak so probably gonna do one more run here and make sure you guys go follow usual suspects that was the original reason for this video was to get you guys to get a chance to win yourselves a tmx pro and get on that wheel game if you aren't on the wheel game or maybe you want to upgrade the wheel game because you're on something that is not as high of a caliber as a tmx pro but now you got a chance So much better. Second gear. Oh, I hit bump stop on lock. Quick brake flick. Oh yeah, I think we're good with the Z92. I'm gonna throw this one more time at Yas Marina before we end because I had gotten a little more comfortable with this car after the last episode and I was able to flick in a little bit harder at Yas Marina circuit. So we're gonna go in, run Yas Marina once or twice to end it completely off. So, I appreciate you guys coming back and watching. I do appreciate the support. Make sure you tap and subscribe. I do appreciate all the support from you guys and all the comments. I do try to be very active in the comment section as well as on uh, Instagram as well. So, E92 is definitely up there. I will be trying one or two more cars throughout this week um, to see where I stand. Uh, I will definitely be getting some tandem. So, you guys are going to be seeing tandem content coming here. Going to be doing maybe an open lobby to uh, try and tandem with some other people. So make sure you stay glued to the channel for that and Instagram as well. I will try and let everybody know ahead of time if I can about running an open lobby unless I just do a spur of the moment open lobby and you guys will find it live on the channel. So hoping to live stream Torque Drift here soon as well. But uh, definitely trying to focus right now on SSR round one, which is in two weekends, because, uh, well, definitely want to put a good showing down in the pro. Hopefully, uh, get a chance to qualify and uh, make it into battles. So, E92, like I said, up there on the high tier of which cars I want to run. So, throw this in, throw our 50 roll. Try to throw this car a little bit harder this time. Right there, nice hard initiation flick. Kind of on that white line. It's a bit better of a run than last time. Really hard initiation though, which is kind of what I'm striving to do. Trying to get a little more style on initiation, trying to snap the angle a lot quicker than I was before. So. The car is heavy, but it is able to hold its own when it snaps pretty quick. So that is one thing that I'm getting comfortable with this car is um, managing the weight on hard snappy transitions because I'm trying to snap the angle quicker than just basically doing a quick like, oh, I'm going to roll into angle here. I'm trying to do a quick, you know, let's quickly snap into angle and uh, get on track. So because I feel like the quick snap to angle is going to be, you know, more style, more points, and it's probably what the judges are going to want to see anyways, because, well, FD wants to see you snap to angle as quickly as possible. They don't really want to see a slow roll, so... I'm trying to do it without a super crazy feint. Like that. Not a super crazy feint. Kind of quick to angle. Over-rotate because of the curves. Do not want to do that in the runs. So, I think that'll do it here for this episode. Make sure you guys go follow these little suspects. Get your chance to win this TMX Pro and Forza Motorsport 7, as well as follow me on Instagram as well. And as always, I thank you guys for watching. I'm Evil Rabbit, and I'll see you guys next time. I'm gonna let up.